Hey there, it's Jeff. I'm the products expert at Zooper. In this video, we will give you a brief overview of the integration between Freshdesk and Zooper. Here we are on an open ticket screen inside of Freshdesk. We are logged into Freshdesk as Michael Brown, and we are raising a ticket for the customer Lisa Martinez. We will walk you through how simple it is to resolve an incident with Zooper and a Freshdesk integration. We will start by filling out the form for Lisa Martinez, who's made a request to have a sign installed. In the subject, we will enter the request, which is a request for a sign installation. Since we received the request over phone, we will enter phone under source, and we will place the priority on medium. Under the agent, we will enter Michael Brown, since he is handling the incident. Select the due date and in the description, you can enter any additional information that was received from the customer or that is necessary for future reference. Since the customer has not provided us with detailed measurements of the signboards and we are not exactly sure how we would like to place the boards, under additional information, we can mention that the field technician will need to make a site visit in advance to determine what exactly has to be done at the customer's location. Once we enter these details, we can go ahead and create a ticket in Freshdesk. Here, you can see the ticket along with other customer details. Now, let's take a look at this ticket. We can create a job from the same ticket here at the ticket screen. In the ticket, we can see all the customer details in the top right. To create a job, scroll down and select Create a Job. Now you can see all the job details that we've entered, like the title, the job priority, and the customer requirements, along with the due date. Now, select the time slot using the assisted scheduling. Select the date you would like to choose from the different views available. For this demo, Let's select a resource view and we will choose Team Miami since the customer is from the Miami area. As you can see now, I am able to see all of the available technicians and the slots for the date that I selected. You can see the job in the assigned technician, Sadie Seller, to fulfill this service for the customer Lisa. I'm choosing the time block, now I will click confirm. Now, the right technician with the right skill set has been assigned to the job. You also have the option to choose the service location from the map. Once the service location is selected from the given map, the location is now mapped with the right geo coordinates. Now, let's choose an asset for this job. Since the customer wanted to set up a signboard, this task requires DTC signs. Hence, from the assets, I am selecting DTC signs and a pole for mounting the sign. Once I get all of that added, I can click confirm. Once you review all the details, scroll to the bottom and select Create Job. As you can see, a job has been created within the ticket on Freshdesk. Once the job is created, you now can open it and see how it looks in the Zooper app. Click Open in Zooper. Now you can see all the details of the job created in Freshdesk showing up in the Zooper web app. You can see the date, the job creation date, the technician that the job is assigned to, you can also see the customer details and the company that they belong to below. You can see the assets that are used for the job. You can also see the exact location of the job on the map. In the bottom left, you can see the Freshdesk ticket ID for this job. Now, let's head over to the Zooper mobile application to get a perspective from the field service technician's view. Now that we have logged into the mobile app as a technician, and the technician has accessed the job on the Zooper mobile application, here, you can see the job displayed. You can see the schedule, you can see the date, you can see the address, as well as all of the information you see here available on the screen. To confirm that the assigned technician, Sadie Seller, is working on the job, she will need to confirm the job. In order to do this, she must select the Change Status button in the bottom of the screen and update the status to On Her Way. Now, you can select the ETA and enter the remarks and update the status. The technician has the option to use location intelligence and use the map to get to the customer's location.
appear at the Fresh Desk ticket screen. We can see that the job status has been updated in real time. Here we can see the customer support agent, Michael Brown, created a ticket for the customer, Lisa, and assigned it to the field technician, Sadie Seller. From here, we also have the option to track the technician. Once you click on the track button, it will bring up the map. This is where you will be able to see the route that the technician must take to get to the customer's location, right from the Fresh Desk ticket. Now, let's go back to the mobile application. The technician is going to update the job status further, seeing that she has arrived at the customer's location. Now, she will update the status to start it. It's that simple, and this status update will be recorded in Freshdesk and Zoopler. The customer can also be sent a notification, giving all corresponding parties access to this important information. Now, let's go back to the Zoopler app to see the status updated. Here you can see the status has been updated along with the time the job was started. Now this field technician can continue to make updates and add information on the Zuber mobile app. Now we are able to see the updates that have been made on the Zuber webpage. Once the job was completed, she marked it as job completed and then she got a signature and a comment from the customer. We can also see the job details, the job notes, and we see the updates that were made on the job with dates and timestamps. There has also been customer feedback that was left, confirming that the job has been completed. All this information is recorded in the Fresh Desk ticket. Now, let's go over to the Fresh Desk ticket and we can see the job status marked as completed. You will notice that all information recorded in Super automatically migrates and is reflected in Fresh Desk. You can see that Sadie Seller, the field service technician for this job, has attached images confirming the completion of this job. You can also see that she has received customer feedback. Under the Activities tab, we can see all the activity done on this job was captured and stored here in Freshdesk for anyone to access at any time. That was a brief overview of how the Freshdesk and Zuber integration works. As you've seen, Freshdesk is tightly integrated into Zuber. You can open a ticket in Freshdesk and have a job created in Zuber. All activities recorded in Zuber are reflected in the Freshdesk ticket records. Remember, we at Zuber offer field service your way.